Welcome to Digital Communication Playlist. Here in this session, I'll be explaining example on Shannon Fano encoding. And in previous session, even I have solved one example on Shannon Fano encoding algorithm. So we will be following same steps. First, we will be writing all those symbols with descending probability. So in order of descending probability, we will first list out all those symbols. Second is we just need to divide message is sets into two equiprobable subset x and y and assign bit 0 to x and assign bit 1 to y subsets and again re subset till you get last code word so that is what we need to follow and then we should write down code word and then we can calculate efficiency and redundancy by using this formula so that is what I have already explained. Now let us have one complex example based on Shannon Fano. So that will clear a little more idea. So here we are dealing with to identify code word for probability 1 by 4, 1 by 4, 1 by 8, 1 by 8, 1 by 16, 1 by 16, 1 by 16 for symbols S1 to S8. Find code word, code, code efficiency and redundancy by Shannon Fano. So here first step is we just need to write down symbols with probability in descending order. So here already it is there in descending order only so we don't need to change order. The reason is 1 by 4, 1 by 4, 1 by 8, 1 by 8, 1 by, 8, 1 by 16, 4 times that is descending order only so we don't need to change anything. So write down symbols related to that so S1. S2, S3, S4, S5, S6, S7 and S8 and probability of those data is 1 by 4, 1 by 4, 1 by 8, 1 by 8, 1 by 16, 1 by 16, 1 by 16 and 1 by 16. Now first we need to divide that into subset with equal probability. So here even we can have equal probability. The reason is this is what 1 by 4 plus 1 by 4 that is half. And if you add 1 by 8, 1 by 8 and 4 times 1 by 16. So that will even result into half. So let us have this is subset X and this is subset Y and this is having bit 0 and this is having bit 1. Again see there are two symbols in this so again just divide it into subsets so 1 by 4 1 by 4 this is having bit 0 this is having bit 1 and here again there are six symbol in this group so if you combine 1 by 8 plus 1 by 8 and 1 by 16 4 times then you can have again resubset over here so this will be having one subset and this will be having other subset and this is what 0 and this is what 1. Now again this 0 that is having two symbols. So we can just now directly divide with subset 0 and 1 and over here over here this group is having four symbols with 1 by 16 probability so 2 will be considered with 0 2 symbols will be considered with 0 subset and another 2 will be considered with 1 and again this is having 2 symbols so I'll consider 0 with this 1 with this and for this 0 with this and 1 with this so that is how we can have subsets and we can go till the last bit. Now write down code word and length of code word. So for S1 if you see code word so that is 0 0 that is 0 0 for S2 that is 0 1 so this is 0 1 s2 for s3 that is 
वन जीरो जीरो दैट इज वन जीरो जीरो फोर एस फोर दैट इज वन जीरो वन सो वन जीरो वन फोर एस फाइव दैट इज वन वन जीरो जीरो सो फोर एस फाइव वन वन जीरो जीरो फोर एस सिक्स दैट इज वन अगेन वन जीरो एंड वन सो वन वन जीरो एंड वन फोर एस सेवन दैट इज वन 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 एंड जीरो वन 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 एंड जीरो एंड फोर एस एट दैट इज वन 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 एंड वन सो दिस इज हाउ वी कैन राइट डाउन कोडवर्ड बाय यूजिंग शैनन फैनो नाउ लेंथ ऑफ कोडवर्ड सो फॉर दिस इट इज टू फॉर दिस इट इज टू दिस इज हैविंग थ्री इज हैविंग थ्री इज हैविंग फोर एंड फोर फोर एंड फोर सो दिस इज हाउ वी कैन आइडेंटिफाई लेंथ ऑफ कोडवर्ड नाउ फॉर अ कैलकुलेशन ऑफ इफिशियंसी for a calculation of efficiency first we need to calculate entropy h and that is summation pi log of base 2 1 by pi so let us have all addition so 1 by 4 probability is occurring two times so two times of 1 by 4 log base 2 1 divided by 1 by 4 that is 4 Plus one by eight probability is happening two times, so two times one by eight log of base two, one by eight that is eight. Plus one by sixteen is happening four times, so four times into probability that is one by sixteen log of base two, one by sixteen is sixteen. Now, if we solve this, then you'll be finding this is. Log four base two that is two, so two plus two into two by four, so that is one. So this is one plus log of base two eight, log eight of base two that is three by eight into two, so six by eight, that is three by four plus this is six log sixteen base two. So that is four into four, sixteen by sixteen. That is one. So you will be calculating this is two point seventy five bits per symbol. Now, secondly, we will be calculating h cap, and that is summation p i n i. So that is just. One by four into two plus one by four into two. This is what code word length, which is n i. So one by four into two plus one by four into two. So two times of one by four into two. Two times of one by four into two plus one by eight into three plus one by eight into three. So two times one by eight into three. Plus one by sixteen into four, one by sixteen into four. That is happening four times. So four times of one by sixteen into four. So if you calculate this, so you'll be finding that is even two point seventy five bits per symbol. So ultimately, efficiency. That is h divided by h cap, and that is two point seventy five divided by two point seventy five. That is one. And redundancy r e that is one minus eta. That is one minus one zero. So there is no redundancy with this code. So this is how we can solve example based on Shannon Fano. I hope that you have understood this session. You reply your queries in questions. Definitely, I'll try to solve your queries. 
and in next session i'll explain little more complex example based on shannon fano so it will be more clear to you how we can solve little more complex examples thank you so much for watching this video